JP, John Pizel, Bins, FCS, here with Keone. He's going to uh, talk about the fins and what kind of boards for and what kind of waves you can uh, ride this with. Okay. Um, full disclaimer, I used it this morning. Oh, did you? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. This is kind of my go-to, actually. It's um, really exciting. This fin is like nothing we have in the line. It's very different um, from where it sits in the box um, to its foil um, to its template. It's very unique. And oh. um, when you look at this fin, if you look at it from the front and you look at the foil, it's very thick down here. And uh, it has a nice taper to it. And then the other thing is look where it sits in the box, very forward. Um, so this allows the water to go around it cleaner early and allows for a lot of directional change, allows for a lot of flexibility, um, allows for tons of options. You know, it, it doesn't it doesn't have that real knifey directional feeling. It's very fun and very playful. Um, but and you know, again, because it sits forward in the box and because it's thicker up here, the foil allows the water to go around it and gives you tons of options. So very So unique. with it being forward, is the board going to feel more, um, like it'll turn a little bit better? Looser, yeah. Looser. Yeah, it feels really loose. For a, for a tri-fin, yeah. this is going to be, um, it's going to feel really, really hot, really loose. Um, but, you know, it's got, if you look at the base, it's got about as much base as any fin in the line, too. So you do have the drive down here. So it's got... Got some really cool key uh, aspects. So then, with the um, the leading edge being foiled, mm -hmm. it'll make the board sit too. Um, or not just... as much because it's a flat foil. Oh, it's a flat yeah, foil. Yeah, oh, I thought you said foil, it was. A... But it's thick. Oh, it's so thick. So if you look oh, at okay. if you look at the overhang on the tab, yeah. it's really interesting. And that was the first thing that I noticed when I saw this. Oh yeah. You look at the overhang, and it's thick. So it's a, definitely a flat foil, but it's thicker. Okay. Yeah. So very unique. I wasn't listening. Yeah. So no. it's a fatter, but it's a flat foil. Oh, yes. okay. Yep. Yep. Oh, interesting. So really different. Yeah. It's 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 a must have in the quiver. Yeah. Yeah. What board did you use it on? Um, what did I use it on? I used it on my Glen Pang this morning. Yep. I got a. Is that like a regular short board or? Yeah, high performance short board all the way. Yep. Wow. Yeah. And it comes in what sizes? Uh, medium and large. Medium and large. Yep. Yeah. So pretty cool. Kind of a cool little outlier. Yeah. Uh, oh, right on. And then what about the back fin? Is it uh, back shorter fin, or? Just a touch different. Yeah. Um, yeah. I mean, you see the kind of the, the jam these days is a slightly smaller trailer, but uh -huh. pretty. Oh, it's almost pretty the same. similar. Yeah. Pretty similar. Huh. Um, yeah. Not a whole lot of that. Um, but I think because the fins are sitting more forward, um, it's got it's got the playfulness. Um, I you know I guess they felt you didn't need it. So um, let's say you have a set of um, performers. Uh -huh. um, do you ride performers or do you ride um, like Merricks or which one do you normally um, ride? I like this? I like the performers. Um, you know I like I like these. Yeah. Um, so if you have the regular performers on uh -huh. and then you surf it with this. Uh -huh. What's the biggest thing or the biggest um, feel that you'll you'll okay. notice? Not to create brain damage here, yeah. but the performers <laughs> have inside foil. Okay. So that's night and day. They have that speed generating inside foil, yeah. which is going to um, generate speed. Yeah. So it's it's going to feel different. Um, the templates are a little different, but um, it has a different foil. It has that inside okay. um, concave foil. So it's going to that is going to feel. Um, you know, it's going to be speed generating. It's going to feel pretty hot. So more you know? projection down the line. Um, yeah, uh -huh. but definite rail to rail. Yeah. You, you, what, what you really feel in that is the the speed between turns. Oh. Not so much your top end down the line, uh -huh. but the way it, um, it it generates speed. Learn that using them on asims, which was uh, it was very apparent uh, using an inside foil fin on an asymmetrical because you only had it on one side, and the way it took off. So, obviously, that's a kind of a different, whole other different yeah, conversation. Yeah, yeah. But um, having them to play off each other really, um, really gives you this uh, flowy feel. Again, not so much down the line, yeah. but the way those inside foils work is it really just keeps you, you know, flowing one side to the it next. It keeps the speed when you're yeah. coming back around. Yes. Oh, yeah. wow. Yeah. 